Hello, fellow nocturnal enthusiasts, and welcome back to our cryptic corner. Today, we're sinking our teeth into the enigmatic world of the vexation of a shut-in vampire princess. I'm John, and if you're as thirsty for details as a vampire on a blood moon night, you're in the right place. Before we unveil the mysteries of episode 10, make sure to subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on all things supernatural. In last episode, Sukuna Memoir showed her precious memories to Terakamari and exposed her true intentions and the reasons behind them. She also disclosed her core implosion and all the crimes she had committed. Her memories reflect how lonely and desperate she is to find a family. However, Terakamari's kindness and acceptance changed Sukuna's heart. Terakamari accepted Sukuna and forgave her even after all the crimes she committed. This acceptance led to the decision that she would no longer be used by Inverse Moon. Odilon, one of the leaders of the Inverse Moon, was quite disappointed and angered after Sukuna decided to leave the Inverse Moon and go against him, which resulted in a fierce battle between them. Unfortunately, Sukuna lost, but in her final moments before losing consciousness, she made Terakamari drink her blood because she knew that whenever Terakamari drinks blood, it evokes her core implosion. Eventually, Terakamari's core implosion awakened, and she engaged in a battle with Odilon. Terakamari overpowered Odilon and emerged victorious in the Crimson Lord's battle. The vexation of a shut in Vampire Princess episode 10 will be relished on 16th or December 17th, 2023. Well, that wraps up our mystical journey into the world of the vexation of a shut in Vampire Princess. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your fellow night owls, and subscribe for more supernatural updates. Until episode 10 graces us with its presence, stay mysterious, stay nocturnal, and as always, happy haunting!